This video is meant to familiarize the rider with the location of information and components on a Polaris Titan adventure. Starting at the front of the vehicle, you will see the front bumper and two side panels. Remove the left side panel to access the oil injection reservoir, spare belt holder, clutch assembly, driven clutch spreader tool, and the spark plug socket. Behind the right side panel you'll find the brake system, the coolant pressure cap, USB port, and the headlight adjustment. Underneath the hood you'll find the fuse panel and the spare spark plug holder. The battery is located underneath the driver's seat. Behind the driver's seat you'll see the passenger seat, storage rack, and storage compartment. The tow hitch is located in the rear of the vehicle. The front suspension contains the adjustable shocks, A-arms, sway bar and links, tie rods, spindle, skis, ski spacers, and skags underneath the skis. Once on the seat, you'll see the mirrors, a power socket, gauge cluster, key switch, and a storage compartment. The left handlebar contains the brake lever, parking brake, brake reservoir, handlebar grip warmer switch, thumb warmer switch, electronic reverse control, mode button, and the headlight dimmer switch. The right handlebar contains the engine run stop switch and the throttle lever. The handlebars can be adjusted by removing the handlebar trim and loosening the four fasteners underneath. Below the handlebars are the intake screens, fuel cap, recoil handle, and the gear shifter. Move to the rear suspension to find the front limiter straps, rail slide, front track shock and adjustments, rear track shock and adjustment, front grease zerk, rear grease zerk, rear limiter straps, torsion spring adjustment, rear idler wheels, and rear idler adjustment. The VIN label is located on the right side of the vehicle above the running board. The VIN is also stamped in the same location. For more information, see your authorized Polaris dealer or visit Polaris.com.